right back at you guys. This is Doug from the internet, and I've got a special, special meal for you today that I'll be trying out. Um, I shouldn't say trying out, though, because I've had this, I don't know how many dozens, if not hundreds of times. It is a staple of my diet, um, but uh, was not for a few months, uh, and then it was closed temporarily. Was it closed temporarily? It's not really important. Uh, what I have for you tonight is a pizza. Specifically, three calzones from a pizzeria in Sherbrooke. Or a pizza. Is it a pizza or a pizzeria? It's a pizzeria. No, it's a pizza. In any case, it's delicious. And uh, the owner and proprietor, Mike, uh, also the, uh, let me just. Let me just get it out. Oh I've been waiting for so long. So we got the sauce, and we picked it up with one cup, two cups, three cups. The delicious pizza sauce. Um, it's a little hot, and it's got, uh, got a little sweet taste to it. Oh, uh, sweetness to it. So what I ordered were, I'm going to play it out here. Ordered three calzones. Uh, two sausage calzones and one veggie calzone. So I'll be eating the veggie and one of the sausage uh, calzones tonight, and then I'm going to eat the uh, second sausage calzone for breakfast tomorrow. This is usually what I do. This is my regular uh, order. Sometimes I'll switch it up. Uh, this is a good steak one, uh, capicola one that he started doing. It used to be ham, but he changed it to capicola because it wasn't selling as well, so much easier to use like a, uh, I guess a more cured meat, uh, and have to get rid of all that ham. Um, uh, anyway, Mike, the, uh, owner, proprietor, and, uh, cook, uh, is a really great guy. I uh, really appreciate him as a person, uh, and, uh, makes great fucking pizza. Uh, specifically the calzones. I mean, both are delicious, but... The calzones are such an important part of my diet because, I mean, look at these pieces. Okay, oh, let's have this veggie. And, okay, um, I think I'll start with, i start with one of the sausages. I'll show you this. Put it back in here, keep it warm with the other one. These things are, um, $6 for the meat-based ones and, uh, $5 for the, uh, I guess, is there, is there just a veggie? Oh, there's a veggie, I think there's a spinach one as well. So it's like just a uh, uh, vegetarian, $5, meat-based, $6. I've got my uh, selection, lemon-flavored water. And you get a fucking soda stream. And seriously, it's, it, is, it is stupid. It is stupid, it is borderline criminal. Uh, I haven't bought a, uh, haven't bought a soda, excuse me, haven't bought a soda stream yet. It's ridiculous. Um, it's the amount of fucking plastic, amount of pollution that I um, put into the world. Uh, don't know if I mentioned it, but I'm once again in the corner of my room because I don't have a car. So uh, let's open this up. Oh my god! Yeah, these things are nice and big. Holy shit! Sauces out of the way. Look at this beauty. You see it? Oh my god. So, the big, tasty, filling. Ingredients are fresh. I mean, I'll stop. I mean, I'm just I'm getting distracted by all the beautiful memories I have of this delicious food. Um, what I'm going to do instead, I'm going to dig in. So, usually what I do is pull it out like this, a bit, yeah. and then can get in like this. I'm not get my hands all, all dirty. Okay. Uh, let's see if I can maybe 
Yeah, there we go. Get it right on the food. So first we have the edge, which is a bit more breaded, so I try to get in right with the sauce. Sometimes there isn't enough sauce. You know, not because Mike is uh, being stingy or anything, it's just because um, sometimes my uh, sauce needs vary based on uh, how I'm feeling. Mm. Mm. Somehow it's exactly as I remembered. I need it better at the same time. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, so sometimes I do supplement with uh, sriracha, especially for the uh, veggie. It's really good because this this sauce is a little has a little bit of heat. I do eat like industrial quantities of sriracha. So I'm starting to eat something with a little, not a lot more key. I mean, sriracha's not that high, but you know, some people it's uh, insanely high. Mm. See that? This one's real simple. That's raw cheese. The tomato sauce. And uh, some sausage. Oh, God damn. Mm. This calzone is hitting on all the deliverables of taste. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, sauce myself up one other bite. And we'll take a look at the veggie, okay? Yeah, there's no, really no point in repeating myself. I think I've said all that needs to be said. Remember, not all that needs to be said, but all that can be said about it without tasting it. I just want to take another bite. Alright, yeah. Okay. Mm. I am destroying this thing. Where should I put this? Mm. I'm sure I don't get sauce everywhere. Yeah, I'm gonna put it over here. Um, now we have the veggie, which is pretty much the um, antithesis of the previous calzone. A yin for the previous one's yang. Ooh, nice. So this one, obviously. Has no meat. It is the veggie calzone. Um, I you can see here. Ah, the smell. I said this is probably his best uh, smelling calzone. Along with the spinach. Because it's. Ah, oh, fuck. I just said it's. I get oil everywhere. Look at this. Look at this thing.
I smell the vegetables already. The bell peppers. I smell the oil. Olive oil. God damn. Okay. So this one, this one's usually look, uh, a lot messier just because of the, the olive oil. Um, it tends to sort of pool up at the bottom, at least with the way that I eat it. With the, you know, wrapping technique, as I call it. Um, the texture of bread is a, the texture of the bread is a little bit different as well, just because it's got uh, it's got that olive oil. So, as you can see on the edges, it gets see the colors. The uh, oh boy, see, uh, not you don't see, you don't see anything. That's okay. We're just gonna go ahead and eat it because uh, that's what we're here for. So I'm gonna sauce up the. Uh, Inaugural bites. With the brittier, uh, your edge just sauced up correctly. It's it's a divine first bite. Okay, so now I've already gotten one cup done. I might I might pop up the sriracha. In a moment, I always have a bottle of sriracha in my room. Right, I think I have four or five bottles of sriracha um, in my kitchen, like unopened. I think it's four now. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. So goddamn good. So, take another one. Mm. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, I can see a bit more inside. Mm. Right, too much light. Mm. Oops. Yeah, I don't see anything. We got bell peppers, onions, mushrooms. That olive oil, um, it's not a pesto, but definitely basil in there. Uh, so good. Some green pepper as well? Okay. No. Oh. Green pepper, bell pepper, cheese, basil, olive oil. It's simple. It's so, it's so simple. But I'm over it. Oops. Five dollars. Five dollars. Come. Gotta bust up the structure. Five dollars for that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to end this pretty soon. I think I'm probably gonna run out of space on my phone again. But you know what? It keeps me humble. And uh, forces me to, you know, get straight to the point. Mm mm mm.
fantastic. This is good. I love it. 10 out of 10. contemplate um, what is the experience right here I'm going to spend some more time with these I'm going to finish them up uh, it's entirely possible it's not it would definitely not be necessary for me to uh, eat the uh, second sausage calzone but it's entirely possible that later on tonight um, if I get a little peckish uh, I'll eat it just because it's so fucking good uh, 10 out of 10, 5 out of 5, any uh, numerical system that you want to use, uh, any fraction, you know, give it a 1, how about that, give it a 1, just whole, there's no, there's no, there's no fraction in there, 1, for a pizza, in Quebec, good night.